Hey, it's Ontarian Hawkins here, the Passive Income Guru. Hope you guys are having a great day so far. Um, seems like it's been a while since I did a video or a live video, but I want to come back to you as always, as promised, to bring you more content, more, uh, uh, more material that's going to excite you, hopefully, in uh, moving forward financially in your life. Uh, you know, my whole goal here in doing videos and starting a business uh, wasn't, it was all about helping people. That was my ultimate goal. Once I broke free, once I broke free from my nine to five, then I, I made a promise to myself to help other people uh, to get give the right information and at the highest integrity. Now, uh, have I made mistakes in the past? Of course, of course. But now, as days go on, uh, I've, I believe I've gotten wiser uh, when it comes to entrepreneurship. And when it all comes down to it, it's still a risk, still a risk. However, if you have faith, okay, if you have faith, if you have, if you can develop a vision, and then the, the catalyst to all of that is if you are sick and tired of being sick and tired, then you can make anything work. So the title of this video, of course, is about American Build Money, but the, the second half of this title, 70% of people, okay, and I'm, I'm, I want to hit on, and it's talking about Americans. I'm going to share my screen in just a second so I can show you what I'm talking about. But 70% of Americans are unhappy with, what do you think that is? Well, let's go to the source. Let's go to the source, okay? 70% of Americans are ha unhappy with their jobs 70% now when I when I when I saw that I mean I knew a lot of people in this country were unhappy with their jobs I was thinking like 40 50% that's still a lot of people but 70% of Americans are unhappy with their jobs guys and this lets me know this lets me know that people are looking for a way out they're looking for a way out they're looking for something different and I believe many of these people are college educated they're they they've been they've been told growing up that college going to college going to school nothing wrong with going to college and getting getting educated but me personally for example i was fed all my childhood growing up go to job i mean i'm sorry not go to job go to school get a job and that's the american dream and i i soon found out when i was in college and i'm i'm glad that's that's one reason I'm glad I went to college because if I didn't go to college maybe I wouldn't be where I am today. Something triggered some something in in college triggered me to think about entrepreneurship. I don't know what it was, but something triggered the thought of being an entrepreneur. And uh I was a young guy, I was in my early 20s and I went on this I went on this 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 quest to find out if people really made money from home, made money online, and this is, you know, long story short, here we are today. I, I found out the truth, and now I'm in a position to help other people find the same truth. So 70% of Americans do not like their jobs. Now, I'm going to scroll down. I read something here. Yes, right here it says, a newly released Gallup report shows that 70% of Americans poll either hate their job. Look at that. Either hate. Now, we all know that hate is a strong word, guys. If you dislike someone or something, I mean, that's, that's mediocre, okay? Dislike. But when you hate, that's a different dimension. When you hate someone, and hopefully you don't hate anyone, but when you hate something, uh, you you pretty much another uh, synonym for that is you despise that that thing. So I can replace this hate word with despise. 
70% of Americans polled either despise their job or are disengaged from their work. And even perks don't work if they're unhappy with management. You see? So people are upset. I mean, look at this guy. <laughs> look at this guy. That's that's the that's the hate mentality. I mean, he he don't care. He don't care if he got uh, coffee on his shirt, his, his white shirt. And he don't care if he's getting on a computer. I mean, this guy is out. He, he's he's enraged. Something something triggered that. And look, check this out. What does this do? Okay, what does this type of stress do to a person? We all know that stress kills. Okay, stress is a slow and silent killer. It will kill you. And that drives stress drives people to do many 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 things to themselves. So stress drives people to smoke. Stress drives people to drink. Stress drives people to overeat. Stress drives people. Hopefully, you get to a point where stress drives you to go exercise. Stress drives you to go get some sunshine. Those are the natural remedies. Okay. <laughs> so stress 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 and people are stressed out you know even the commute to work for some people is stressful the commute to work and then once you get to work you have to deal with a boss that may that may be giving you the blues you may have to deal with some co-workers that that may not like you or you don't like them i mean it's just stress and then you come home and you bring that negativity you bring all that negativity back home to your spouse to your kids and you know, you know, your home, your home is probably not a a place where um, the light shines, so to speak. So it's it's a ripple effect. It's a domino effect. And I remember when I was working, uh, uh, you know, some particular job that I didn't care for. It it just it trickled over into other things, and it's not good, guys. All right. Now I'm saying this to say this. There's always, there's always a way out, okay? If you want out, if you really, really, if you really, really want out and you just sick and tired of being sick and tired, there is a way out. There is a way out. Here's the, here's the problem. The problem is people, people are not wanting to take the initiative okay they're fearful and they they around so much negativity that they can't see past what they already are you know obliged to or already accustomed to so it's a it's a mindset shift it's a mindset shift when you went to college for example then you prepare your mind to say hey I'm going to get this degree no matter what then you say to yourself I paid this money I'm going to, I'm going to give it all I got. If I if I fail, great. I'm going to pick myself back up and and keep going. Did you say that to yourself? Hopefully, the same thing happens in entrepreneurship. You're gonna, you know, you're gonna come in here and give it all you got until you 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 get that breakthrough that you want. That is what it's all about. I see so many people come in in entrepreneurship and they treat it like a hobby. You got to treat this thing like an uh, entrepreneur and it will pay you like an entrepreneur okay so with that said hopefully i i, I kind of drill that in to you and you can uh, you know kind of shift your mindset a little bit but with that said i want to present to you of course american bill money is a way out now this is only for americans it's only for usa residents okay international folks my apologies you can't you can't participate in this one uh but hopefully soon we this may go international we don't know okay but this is for my American folks, uh, especially if you're in the 70, 70 percentile of those who hate their jobs, okay? There is a way out. There is a way out. And American Bill Money has been around since 2003, okay? Real business has a high rating, A rating, A plus rating with the Better Business Bureau. And basically, it's a direct mail order business. Now, you may be wondering, well, why are you doing videos if it's a direct mail order business? Well, the key to, to success in business is leverage. And me as, a, me as a marketer as well, 
I leverage everything, every marketing avenue that I can get my hands on. You say, okay, every marketing avenue I can get my hands on: video, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat. Uh, I'm about to start mailing out these postcards. And P.S. And by the way, these postcards you see right here. I talked to Paul, the owner, and P.S. And by the way, again, I have a great relationship with Paul. Talked to him this morning. Uh, he's uh, he, We have some new postcards. You should have got an email about it. We got some new postcards coming out. You're going to be able to customize it with your picture on there if you want to. That's going to help with branding. That's going to help with personalization. That's going to help close more sales. So if you want to do this, passively without having to do videos like I'm doing you can do it guys you can do it so I'm going to be on going on a rent a mailing rampage here in the next what two two and a half weeks a mailing rampage guys so I'm going to take this business offline because here here lately I've been doing it all online and I like leverage I'm a, I can see past you know I, I don't have any more fears but, but when I did, I, I've learned how to see past the fears. And when I join a business, I give it all I got, okay? I don't give it 30 days. I don't give it 60 days. I don't give it 90 days. I give it all I got. And all I got is the, the time. There's no time limit on that, okay? And you shouldn't put a time limit on your business either. I see people come to me. I haven't, I haven't got paid yet. What's what? You know, I'm thinking about quitting. I'm thinking about, you know, no. Did you quit in college? Did you quit before you found your spouse? Did you say, oh, you know what? I'm just going to be single the rest of my life. I'm just going to be single the rest of my life and just, and, and just, you know, love myself. Okay. Did you do that? Did you, did you, did you say I quit? Did you say I quit before you went on that job interview? When the when the when the when the employer said we you know we can't you know you don't have enough qualifications to to meet our standards. Did you quit or did you go? Did you fill out more applications for the interview? Guys, same concept. It's about vision. It's about faith. It's about tenacity. It's about optimism. Okay, optimism. Not pes Not being a pest pessimistic be an optimist I'm an optimistic person okay so this is a this is a this is a sexy home-based business guys okay it's the first time I've used it on video this is this is sexy and I mean I say that because of the turnkey business we have here you don't have again you don't have to you can mail out these postcards there are plenty of people in this business who are making five six figures a year mailing out postcards and a lot of them probably are not on Facebook or on uh, YouTube. Okay, it's for not do it. You know, people ask, do they do they work? Do the yes. It's a numbers game, guys. Think about this. Let me let me bring up my uh, my whiteboard here. It's numbers. Marketing is numbers. Okay, so let's say for example, you have a thousand postcards you want to send out. Okay, let's let's just be let's just say two percent respond and sign up. Okay, that's about twenty people times seventy five dollars. Okay, now you're going to get seventy five dollars per month. This is residual income opportunity. Now this is not a direct sales. You gotta you know you make one sale and and uh, you're done and you got to go out and do it again. No. This is residual, residual income. $75 times 20 is $1,500 extra in your pocket per month. Now, did you, did you break even? The cost of this, I don't know the exact numbers, but it's not that much. Okay, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna, I'm gonna guesstimate for postage for postage you know if you do if you just do postcards uh, you're looking about a little bit of three hundred dollars and then for a thousand postcards cover letters well actually just postcards yeah you you you've well and you've way over it you you you've broken even and then some not even you're not even paying a thousand dollars for 
a thousand postcards with our company. So fifteen hundred dollars. That's not one time. That is per month, guys. Residual. All right. I and mean, what you do, you take a portion of that income, you invest it back into your business, and 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 continue the cycle. Okay. Get those postcards out. Postcards. And again, we're getting new postcards coming out. Um. Very soon here, I talked again. You know, I talked to Paul, and it's going to be company wide. Okay, now I ordered mine already, and uh, I got some cover letters going too. So I'm going to do a combination of postcards, and also a combination, um, a combination of postcards and cover letters. So I got that coming to my to my home here, real soon. So I'm about to take this offline. Okay. And you may be you may be wondering, well, what about the lead sources? Don't worry, got you covered. Okay, we got lead sources too. Thanks to my good friend Michael, Michael Merriweather. He's probably going to be looking at this or, or watching this. Uh, talked to him last night. He's had some great success in the past offline, and uh, he he gave me some some of his secret sauce and and lead lead sources and everything. And I got some other lead sources too. I'll be testing out, but. Uh, Believe you me, once I start those sign ups start coming in, guys, you will you will hear about it, okay? You will hear about it. So it's about it's about let me just recap and say this. 70% of people, 70% of people hate their job. Okay. Now I'm gonna end this with a quote from Paul, the owner of ABM. Okay. Look at this. Powerful. He said. Stop allowing doubt, fear, and worry keep you broke. I'm going to I'm going to read that another time, one more time. Stop allowing doubt, fear, and worry keep you broke. Take charge of your future. Two to five hours a week following our simple instructions can easily double your income. Okay? Who doesn't have an extra two to five hours a week? I mean, even an hour a week would do you okay. All right. So, guys, get started. My the link to join is well, the information to join is below this video. If you're sick and tired of being sick and tired, and if you find yourself in 70 percent in the 70 percentile of Americans who are negative about their jobs, then you need this opportunity. And uh, the other thing that you're going to get with this with us, with joining our team, you're going to get support. We have a Facebook group. We're going to give you the strategies you need that we're using. We're going to give you everything, the whole kitchen sink, so that you can be successful with this opportunity. Okay? So I think I've said enough. I think I've drilled enough, drilled this home enough, and uh, for you to make an educated decision to, to make a change. You see? It's up to you. I'm just... All I do here is present, okay? I don't convince anyone to join me in any of my businesses. Every video that I do, I don't twist anybody's arm. All I do is present you the opportunity, and it's up to you to take that opportunity in your hands, okay? So thanks for watching, guys. Let me get this up here. All right. Thanks for watching. God bless. Enjoy the rest of your day. It is sunny and blue skies out here. I think I'm going to go to the gym and get a little workout in before uh, our hangout tonight, uh, this evening for American Build Money. Okay, so we have our American Build Money hangouts every Wednesday at 4 p.m. Central Standard Time. And it, it probably is going to max out again like it did last week. So if you want to get on that hangout, message me directly on Facebook. I'll send you the information because you have to register. All right. And uh, we'll get you on. So, again, uh, Ontarian Hawkins here. Thank you for watching the Passive Income Guru and looking forward to helping you succeed financially for many years to come, starting today. Starting today. All right. Take care. God bless. Talk to you soon.